tubisobanure yuko imirimo akazi abantu bose bajyaga mu kose karakomeza cyangwa cyo tungire tugishimangire nta kintu na kimwe abantu bakoraga uyu munsi iki kibujijwe gihagaritswe icyo dusaba nuko umuntu ufite bya bimenyetso ngiye no kubisubira umuri rukabije kugira umutwe ukabije cyane kuba bara mu ngingo no mu mikaya ugacika intege cyane no kuba bacibgamo kwaruka cyangwa se wahitwa byo nibyo bimenyetso byibanze bikunda kuranga intangiriro y'iki cyorezo utarabigira ntabwo abayanduza abandi bashoboka ko amara cyacyumweru cyangwa bitari wandu cyangwa se warangira itaragira bimenyetso binasobanura impamvu ni ya matemba buzi aza kubera ko unarwaye ya virus irimo ikura mu ntabwo rero wavuga ngo umuntu wese uri kuri moto ngo turamubujije kugenda nta nibimenyetso afite nta numutwaye ntabyo ahubwo ni nayo mpamvu ivuga ngo biraba ku mutima w'umuntu kugitike biraza biraba ku ruhare rw'umuntu kugitike ko ngo ariko numva afite bya bimenyetso ngende cyangwa ngo mu ruko turakubwira ngo niba ufite cyo bimenyetso ubikomezanya ubijya muri ya mirimo ahubwo ni wowe dukeneye yuko waduhamagara imere imwe kane cyangwa se kugura kwegere girango banagwena
um, and uh, avoiding close contacts with infected uh, individuals, um, uh, contacting blood or blood uh, or body fluids uh, is the main route of transmissions, um, as well as touching um, uh, surfaces and objects of infected patients. So it's very important to note that once you see these symptoms, inform uh, uh, the Rwanda Medical Center at 114, as well as also contacting the facilities. Uh, all facilities have been used on uh, precautions, and we want to make sure uh, all the uh, means to stop uh, this spread uh, in place uh, very quickly, and we convey this mes message also uh, media, community, civil society organization present here. Uh, we want to work closely with you, uh, sharing the right information to the public, because during this time of uh, pandemics, there's a lot of infodemics and false information spread by uh, people with uh, sometimes intentions that are not going to help us uh, uh, stop this uh, outbreak. So that is what uh, I have to say. Um, have to take your questions and uh, suggestions. Thank you. Thank you, sir. So we we'll proceed with receiving questions. Tujye kwa kiri bivazo. Mubaza, iti bivazo. Mubazo, kiri bivazo. Tugiri, itanga kumakuru, ukorela. Hanyuma, tufite, avadra di yezo sike sivile, ano. Kande, mukona, ono yamaripiwe, tukumye, kumbu, yagolisi, kuhisha kiri mjiangoy, 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 we will receive three questions, if you allow, uh, Minister. Starting from uh, Asunta, from POA. Say your name. Or French? Uh, English. English, all right. Thank you. Um, so, 
that's a, an, an important question again. Um, where the disease started, um, we we still tracing uh, to see if it started in country or elsewhere. But within the country, the first case tested um, was from uh, one of the university teaching hospitals within Kigali. Was a patient followed in uh, emergency um, uh, care ICU, mm -hmm. uh, which have, were not responding to other treatments. And uh, many tests were conducted, including uh, these viral diseases. There are many, and this happened to be positive. Uh, from there, uh, contacts and tracing other contacts, and that's where also uh, healthcare providers, um, some of them already developing symptoms, uh, were tested, became positive. That is mainly uh, from hospital as uh, it happened in the other outbreaks. This uh, type of disease, most of the time, if not all the time, they, they start from hospitals, uh, because if you are sick, you go to a hospital anyway, and uh, that explains why healthcare providers are the most at risk. And so far, the uh, more than 8% of the patients we have are actually uh, healthcare workers or staff within, within those uh, departments uh, taking care of uh, very sick patients. Thank you.
Kijani nuvuzi, awali awapo ni miche chorezo, ba 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 tarar ba tararere, ba changu sina ba rengi, kwa jamii ya kumura visi kwa na vitu vima na vivyo sse ni retero kwaanda ilikubijita, kijani miche nuvuzi vivyo sse ni kubijendi hawa chorezo miche, ni chona kusubi za nomba ni chovu za kumi, nakuz. Structured. So the ministry has set up uh, cells, clusters, 
uh, and these experts will come in and they'll be integrated into those clusters themselves so that they can provide guidance uh, to the country in the, in the response. In addition to that, uh, to the human resources, of course, you know that's our expertise. We're a technical agency, so we mainly focus on technical expertise. But in addition to that, we're also providing support in the other areas. Uh, for example, we are providing support in getting testing equipment, because that's very critical at this stage to make sure that the government, the country, can be able to do the testing that it needs. We're providing um, uh, PPE equipment, so some of those, uh, we've already made arrangements, are uh, being flown into the country. Some will be arriving, uh, I think some arrive tonight, some tomorrow, and in the next week we'll be receiving more of that equipment. Uh, we're also bringing in other critical supplies for infection prevention. We are bringing in um, equipment and supplies that can be used to treat um, so that's the initial equipment that we're expecting in the next few days, 500, 500 patients uh, we have marked. So we are working very closely with government to ensure that uh, we help them in terms of providing some of these needs. Of course, some of these needs we do it in collaboration with other partners because WHO may not be able to bring in all, all that's needed for government. So we are working very closely with government and our other partners to ensure that we're coordinated and we ensure that uh, we don't overlap in terms of the work that we are um, actually doing. Uh, I think as I close, I want to um, just come back to the media and talk a bit. I know uh, um, Minister has mentioned it, but I want to re-highlight it. You are a very critical, you are very critical partners in stopping this outbreak. You really are core and critical. You have to provide accurate information, and Minister talked about the risk of infodemics. And we know we already have a challenge that there's been a lot of rumors floating around. So it's really important for you as the media to help address this by ensuring that accurate information is made available to communities. Uh, you know, uh, what is Marburg? How is it spread? How can it be prevented? We are working with government in terms of uh, developing the materials that are necessary, and it will be critical for you to ensure that working with government and the materials available, you take them and will be available to work with you to make sure that you can adapt and use them for, for informing the population. So we believe as WHO that together the government and the people of Rwanda can stop this Marburg outbreak very quickly. And we are committed as WHO together with our other partners to work with government in this regard. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. If you allow one question, we can take our last question. You have three hands.
nabyo twakoze mu gihe kibindi byorezo byabanje hari nibindi mutajya mumenya kuko bihagarikwa vuba vuba mu minsi mike bikabirangiye ariko iki ibindi bifata amezi cyangwa ibindi duhora duhanganye na 